Oh boy. This one seems like it's got a decent amount of weight to it. Always close. Oh, decent walleye. Oh, oh, come on. Come on. Come on. There we go, baby. Let's go. Yeah. Hello everyone, welcome back to NB Edits. Today I am running a solo man trip up here in northern Wisconsin and I am going to be chasing down some Wisconsin gold, baby. You heard me right. Going to be going after some northern Wisconsin walleyes again, hitting a pristine lake out in the middle of nowhere. And I'm going to go ahead and just give you guys a hint right now as to where I'm fishing. Do you think I'm going to tell you the name of the lake that I'm on? You're absolutely nuts. Get off your couch and go find some ice. I'm gonna try and be as nice as possible, but we have had numerous, numerous comments on all of our most recent videos asking, where the heck are you guys fishing? What's the name of that lake? Listen, I'll tell you where Nick and I fish. The counties that we typically fish are Oneida, and Vilas. That's typically where we get out fishing. If you're up in northern Wisconsin, even if you're down in central Wisconsin or wherever, if you want to get out and find ice, we have found ice in both of those counties and a couple others too, but those are kind of the ones where we've had the most luck as far as safe ice and also getting out on top of some fish. So again, I'm out here all by myself. I don't have Nick with me. The other night my buddy Mike came with and uh, he got into some nice fish and I'm hoping that I can capitalize and get on some fish tonight too. I'm only going to be using tip ups and uh, I can only put three lines in the water. So I'm gonna do my best. No guarantee I get into any fish tonight, but I'll tell you what, this lake that I'm fishing, whew, she holds some giants. It's not a huge body of water, henceforth the reason why it's frozen and has such good ice. But uh, yeah, let me just tell you right now, it's gonna be a darn good night of fishing. So let's go ahead, get right into it. I'll see you guys as soon as I get hooked up. Well, just got our first flag. Now again, I'm out here all by myself, so uh, I'm limited on resources. I don't have anyone to hold the camera. I don't even have a freaking tripod with me, so this is gonna be interesting. I'm gonna go ahead, set the camera down. Hopefully I can get enough light on this, and hopefully we get our first fish of the night. Let's do this. Alrighty guys, well, no movement out of her yet. Man, is it cold out here. I'm gonna go ahead and set these down. No movement at all yet. I don't even have a freaking headlamp, you guys. This is insane. Definitely should have brought more stuff with me. I'm gonna go ahead and get myself prepared just because you truly never know what can come out of this lake. Okay, here we go. This could be first walleye of the year for me. Go ahead and break free some of this ice. All right. Just a thin layer of ice on there. No movement yet. Oh God, it's spooled. It's spooled. Oh goodness. Okay, it's running out towards the deep. Fish on. Fish on. Oh God. Here we go. Here we go. Starting to feel some weight. It's starting to fight. Oh, yep, yep, there's some fight in them. Okay, come on, buddy. Come on. Oh, man. I don't know how far out he is. How did he spool me? Oh, my goodness. I never heard this tip up go up. Oh, there we go, he's starting to fight. Oh, boy, this is exciting. This is exciting. First fish of the year for me. Come on, baby. Come on. Hopefully, it's a decent walleye. Oh my goodness, he went out deep. Ooh, ooh. Okay, now he's going this way. He's gotta be getting closer. Oh, I can feel him. Yep, yep, head shakes. We're getting close now. Yep, there's the leader. Oh, big walleye. Big walleye. Come on, baby. Yes! Let's go. Nice walleye. Let's go, baby. Look at that. Beautiful northern Wisconsin walleye. Yes, my first of the year, baby. Whoo, oh, oh, oh. that is freaking exciting. Nice slot fish. Look at the gold on that fish. Let's go. That is freaking awesome. Out here, solo manning this trip. I just got myself beautiful, beautiful late night northern Wisconsin walleye. Let's go, baby, let's go. Hopefully you guys can see that really well. Man, that is a gorgeous fish. I'm gonna go ahead and get him unhooked right away and I can hopefully show you guys a little bit better presentation. Man, he fills up the hole. Oh, 
let's go baby just gonna go ahead and give you guys a nice clean look at this fish that is a gorgeous fish look at that that is freaking awesome. I'm gonna say this fish is probably 23 inches, 22, 23 at least I'd say. A very healthy fish, probably right around that four pound range. She's got a little bit of a belly on it. Wow, that is freaking awesome. Alrighty guys, we're gonna go ahead and get a release on this big northern Wisconsin water. Oh man, 24 and a quarter inches. Ooh, I didn't think it was that big. Just got a measurement on it. She's gonna be ready to go. She's got plenty of life in her. What an awesome fish. What an awesome way to kick off 2020 ice fishing season. There she goes, just like that. Ooh, that is freaking exciting, baby. Let's go. Alrighty guys, well, Tip up number two. No movement out of this one yet either. Well, I have not gotten any movement out of it, so I think I'm just gonna go ahead and take this. Right, tip up is free. Does not appear to be a lot of line out. Feel a tiny bit of tension, but I think it's just the minnow. Oh, he's going crazy. That must have been the biggest minnow of the night. All right. Well, at first I thought I had like a tiny little perch on or something, but I figured it's way too late for that. Nope, just a big old sucker minnow. That's all I'm using out here tonight is sucker minnows. All right, got that one all set back up. Go ahead, drop her down. And we'll see if we get lucky and get another one on that tip up. <clears throat> Holy crap, oh my goodness, okay. This thing is just running like wild. Here we go, third flag of the night. This fish was definitely just here. Got him. Let's go. Feels like a little bit more weight than the first one. What do we have here? Hopefully a nice sized walleye. Oh, that one was just spinning when I got to it. It's scary when they take out a decent amount of line, you get up to it and it's really, really spinning. And then all of a sudden it just stops. And I was so scared. Then it really started spinning again. Started up the camera. Oh boy. This one seems like it's got a decent amount of weight to it. Could be about the size of the first one. That first one went 24 and a quarter. Always oh, close. Oh, decent walleye. Come on, come on, come on. There we go, baby. Let's go. Another dandy walleye. Look at that. About the same size as the first one, maybe just a tad bit longer. Oh yeah, for sure. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Absolutely gorgeous fish. Let's go. Look at those rich, dark gold colors to them up here. Nothing better. Out here, on my own, solo mission, and you get another fish like that, that is what I'm talking about, baby. I'm gonna go ahead and get this guy unhooked. Very important to keep these fish in the water as long as you can. Obviously, we want these fish to go back healthy. I'm not keeping any fish. What a freaking dandy. Oh my gosh, another one. Just as big as the first one, maybe even bigger. This fish just absolutely crushed it. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get a release on this big girl. Nothing better than getting up here and just chasing these frickin' tiger stripes, man. This is absolutely awesome. What a frickin' night. Another just gorgeous fish. With the dorsal up, darn near fills up the hole. Another frickin' giant. Whew, there's a little kick out of her. Come on, sweetheart. Let's get ready to go back. And just like that. There she goes. Tail flip goodbye. Oh, another Wisco giant, baby. Let's go. Oh, three flags, two fish, two giants, baby. That is what I am talking about. Let's go. Woo! All right, guys. Well, I think that's gonna do it for me out here tonight. It's getting late. 
I got to get back home. But man, we had ourselves an evening out here. Unbelievable, perfect conditions. It's freezing cold, but we do have a decent amount of light from the moon. It just, it worked in my favor. Got out here the other week, just absolutely slammed some fish and uh, Man, it's good to get out here on a solo mission and get some on my own. So if you guys haven't seen it, go ahead and check out our last video. Mike, my buddy Mike lost an absolute giant. I mean, the thing had to have been at least six or seven pounds plus. Terrifying to think of how big that fish was before it came up and it just hit the top of the hole and lost it. He did get another one though, so that was a fun time. And then to get out here tonight and catch two fish like that myself, absolutely unreal i mean so grateful it's a little scary being out in the woods all by myself i'm not gonna lie usually i've got nick or one of the other guys out here fishing with me but uh yeah tonight solo mission i would say went pretty well so if you guys enjoyed make sure to give this video a big old fat thumbs up i am very thankful to be on the grind and out here and absolutely killing it in the game so if you guys enjoyed make sure to give the video a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe you're not going to want to miss the future content we have this is just early ice guys it gets better there's more ice to come more videos bigger fish which is crazy but bigger fish we're hopefully uh going to be chasing those dirty 30s here soon always on the grind thank you guys so much for watching until next time tight lines from nb edits